All right, here's some basics about this calculator. If you are given a decimal number and you want to put it in scientific and you want to see that number expressed in scientific and engineering mode, if you go to shift mode setup, one, one, and you go say 0 0.0055 for example when you hit equals it gives you a fraction then you hit S to D and it gives it to you in scientific then you can get engineering this is in scientific mode we're gonna stay in scientific mode but let me show you a trick if you go shift mode setup math 2 when you go 0 0.0 zero zero five five and you hit equals it gives it to you in scientific and you do not have to hit the S to D, F to D button and there you go it's just that easy let's try another example zero point five five if we do that it gives it straight to us in scientific then we hit engineering okay let's go back to math mode one one one. Let's try that same number again. Zero point five five. If you hit equals, yep, gives it to you in a fraction. Then you got to go to scientific. Then you got to go to engineering. Since we never lose, never use fractions in this class, I guess we should always say shift mode setup math two. Zero point five five. Give me my scientific. Give me my engineering. And if we're starting in scientific 1.7 times 10 to the negative 9 we want decimal we hit equals to get decimal if we are in shift mode setup normal 2 shift mode setup math 2 so that's 1.7 times 10 to the negative 9 equals that for our decimal notation equals that for our engineering notation now if we want to go from a decimal notation that is a less than 1 you have to and get it in and see it in scientific you have to go shift mode setup 7 3 let's put that number in uh, we had a 0 0.0055 hit equals notice I didn't get the fraction I got the scientific engineering okay that's better than shift mode setup math one because then if you go 0 0.0055 we're in scientific mode but it's gonna give me a fraction then I gotta change it so what I want to do is in shift mode setup math two 0 0.0055 bam engineering yep cool